The Hot Seat brought to you by Capit, your destination for the ultimate overland truck caps, Alucab and Smart Cap, available at Capit. All right, time for week two of the hot seat here on Securus and Price. You get us started. Okay, I'm going to the Vancouver Canucks bench. Bruce Boudreaux, we all know he's a lame duck coach, does not have a contract beyond this season. We all heard management last year say we need to see more. They want to see this team play with more structure, better breakouts on the defensive end, better practice habits, incorporate more data. So despite gaining 65% of the available points last year, Bruce Boudreaux is coaching for his NHL life here. And I've got him on the hot seat, particularly because you remember 8, 15, and 2 mm-hmm. to start the year last year. The Canucks absolutely sewered themselves in the early going. Can't happen again. Need a better start. Bruce Boudreaux. On the hot seat. Interesting. You've got a guy starting his season, the pressure that he feels launching into it. I've got a guy feeling the pressure because the season is now over. And that's actual Schuster. And you're probably thinking, on the hot seat. He's he got just, a contract he extension. He just signed an extension. Yeah. And now he feels the pressure to fulfill that extension, live up to it. Yeah. And he's got a lot of work to do. It's a team that missed the playoffs after making it last year. How does he show traction from year to year if he's not making the playoffs? Well, he needs to make unequivocal you know, positive moves in the offseason. To me, yeah. that's the back line, giving some help to Ranko Veselinovic, and more importantly, perhaps a certified double-digit goal-scoring striker mm-hmm. that can now convert the service that guys like Ryan Gold and Julian Gressel will give to them going forward. Lots of work to be done. Yep. Tell us who you'd put on the hot seat. Brought to you by Cap It. Your adventure starts at Cap It.